Hello everyone and welcome to the world's first Barista Games. <laughs> really good. That felt real. In this series, we're showcasing what an everyday barista does by throwing some challenges at them that you guys have probably never seen in a competition before. But that's enough of me talking. Let's meet the contestants. Hey guys, my name's Zach. I am a contestant in the very first Barista Games. I'm an ex barista. I no longer work in this industry anymore, but I have over 10 years experience with coffee. I'm willing to see if I've still got it. Let's see how we go, guys. I'm Adrian. I've, I've been in the industry for three years. Um, I own a cafe. Um, reason why I joined the Barista Games is to just, this is actually my first competition, so just want to have fun, enjoy, and um, soak in what's expected here at the Barista Games. Hey, I'm Maddie. I've been a barista for six months in a really fast-paced takeaway cafe, and we have a lot of fun. So I really want to bring that here and bring some of that like fun and energy into the game. So I'm really excited. I've brought my boyfriend Connor in today because he was a barista and he thinks he's a lot better than me at home. So um, I'm here to show him today that I'm actually really, really, really good. I'm Connor. Uh, I don't really know why I'm here, to be honest. I shouldn't be. Kind of just here with Maddie. She wrote me into this, so if I look like an idiot, blame her. I'm just here to muck around, basically, and waste Mitch's time. <laughs> hey, my name is Fim. Um, I've been a barista for ten years, six years, uh, six years head barista, especially coffee. Um, excited to be here. This is actually going to be a fun, exciting uh, competition because not much happening in the West, and I'm excited to be part of it. And um, good luck to all every competitor that we have to be peace. Man. Hey, I'm Ashlyn. I work at Underground Coffee Roasters as a roaster usually, but I'm keen to give a crack and see how my barista skills go. Uh, I'm interested, I do a lot of cakes, and so I enjoy the precision of coffee as in roasting and in cakes. I'm super keen to be here and see what everyone else can do, maybe learn a little bit from them as well, and show off my skills that I think I might have. <laughs> Hi, my name is Daniel. I'm excited to be part of the Brewster Games. Um, I, in the coffee industry, have my own coffee roasting business and I have a two group machine at home. And I'm excited to see what will happen today and how everything will go. Well, I know I'm different from you people, but I am who I am. And who are you, I hear you ask? I am an esteemed fake barista. <laughs> no, I'm Justin. I'm here to judge the world's first barista games. I've actually seen a short script of these challenges and I'm really excited to see what these baristas can bring to the table. I'm really excited to have uh, Timothy Sweet as a judge with me because he actually knows what he's talking about. So once again, I'm Justin, a judge. I'm really excited to be here. Hi, my name's Tim. I'm a judge here at the first ever Barista Games uh, out in Sydney's West where apparently they claim that that's where the best coffee in Sydney is. They said everything in the East is rubbish and um, they're here to pull shots and take names. And uh, nah, we're just having a bit of fun with it. Uh, test our skills and have fun together. Now all of our baristas are going to walk away with prize packs. Some from our friends over at the Spro Bros getting some merch some RG filters that all of these guys will be taking home as well, which is really cool. And these guys don't even know yet. The winner will be taking home a $300 worth of brew wall, which is pretty cool. Those guys are throwing some stuff in. Well, that's enough of the talking. Let's get into the challenges. So the first challenge is actually an immunity challenge so that they can't be eliminated from the competition in this round. Now this one's called the waiter because a big part of this job is being able to carry coffee to the table without spilling a drop. So we're gonna fill two cups to the brim with 240 ml of water each. We've got a bit of an obstacle course for them and then whoever comes back with the least amount of water in the time because every second added also takes a mil off their weight. Two, one, go. Three, two, one, go. 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 Go! Oh. 
All right, so in third place, we have Adrian on 36 points. Come on over, mate. Come on. So I get you to come over here for absolutely no reason. Okay. Um, in second place, Fim on 30 points. Yeah. Good job, mate. Well done. And Zachy, the surprise, the winner. Good job, mate. I honestly thought you were going to fail at that. That's all right. So that's great. Now, 110% effort. The round's over, and that was for immunity. But you get to decide whether you keep the immunity so you can't get it knocked out of the next round before you know what we're going to do, or back yourself, give up immunity, and you get an extra point if you make it to the final. It could be the make or break. Send it. I think we're going to pass on the immunity. Yeah? You're going to give yourself the extra point? Yep. All right. Let's Good job. That's brave. Let's move on to the next challenge. So moving into our elimination rounds, the first challenge is speed. Who can do the five espressos as fast as possible? The winner gets one point that goes to their final score, and then the bottom two have to face one-on-one -on -one in the next challenge. All right, mate, how you feeling? Pressure. Pressure, you work in a pretty fast paced cafe. Oh, no excuses here, mate. <laughs> All right, you ready? In three, two, one, go. Are you ready? <laughs> Three, two, one, go. All right, buddy, you ready to go? Yes. All right. Three, two, one, go. Gotta do that one again. It's actually stopped. Oh no, what has he done? We've got ourselves a dirty distribution tool. He's gonna be like the best. Oh no! Time! <laughs> <laughs> yes. All right, buddy, are you ready to go? Yes. Let's go in three, two, one, go. Four twenty-five, and he's only got two coffees down. He hasn't broken any tools yet, though, so. <laughs> We're still looking good. Mate, I think it goes by who got their third coffee done. I'm going to uh, Well, you know. Over. Over. 31. To the wire. Oh, he got it! Oh, he's got it! Yeah. Yeah. He finished! Yeah. Yeah. All right, up next we've got Fim. Are you ready, buddy? All right, in three, two, one, go. So after that entertaining round, thanks to somebody breaking my stuff, um, we've got some numbers. Um, now, we have to say in last place is Connor, because he's got a DNF. Round of applause. Round of applause. Yes. Um, now, in second last place is Daniel, with eight minutes, 11. It wasn't exactly fast, but he got there in the end and didn't break anything, so thanks, mate. Um, then, ooh, it was a close one after that. We've got Maddie on five minutes and four seconds. Good job, good job. Then fourth place, Ashlyn, five minutes and one second. And then the top three, we've got Fim, four minutes 35. That was a good job. Uh, then Adrian, four minutes three, solid. But of course, Zach, again, backing himself. 
Three minutes 51, absolutely smashed it. So, that puts Zach on two points. So Zach is winning this competition quite a bit. But no one gets eliminated just yet because the bottom two for elimination need to battle it out with latte art. So we've got Connor versus Daniel. They're gonna throw down their best latte art using whatever milk they like. And we're gonna see who wins. And unfortunately, whoever loses this round is out. Yeah. Let's go do some latte art. Daniel first. Let's go. So we're gonna get Zaki pulling shots because he's clearly the king of espresso. And then as soon as Daniel's ready, he's gonna start doing his latte. Until the sun comes up. Until the sun comes up. Absolutely you can. Symmetry. So this is the handle mm -hmm. that we're looking for. Yes, symmetry. So we are, we are missing symmetry. All right guys, are we ready to decide? So on the count of three, I want you to put your verified San Pellegrino lid in front of the latte art that you think wins. And then of course, the other competitor gets eliminated. Three, two, one, go. Oh, that's the winner. Ten faces and their coffee order. Some bold chocolate notes to represent the tall mountains. And finally, some bright fruits. <laughs>